Hey, what's going on, guys? Snoopoo7 back with some more Clash of Clans single player on my Galaxy S7. So we're going to be attacking another uh, goblin village here, this one called Gold Rush. And this is actually uh, the worst I've done uh, on any of the attacks so far for a few reasons. I made uh, a few mistakes. So first of all, I probably just didn't have enough troops. Uh, you can see I have 15 foot soldiers, only 5 archers, 5 of these, uh, these looters, and only 2 of the big giants. And also the setup of this village is pretty good. It's got, it kind of funnels you into these two areas and it, and it has cannons on all four corners. So it's a pretty tough setup uh, if you aren't doing it right. And I was kind of testing it out. This, this was the first time I had these guys that, the little green guys that specifically go and try and uh, attack the buildings, like the loot buildings. So in this case, the, uh, the little gold deposits there. So they're not very good for getting the cannons destroyed, which is really what I kind of needed with this particular map. Uh, would have helped if I had some more of the big giants instead. That would have actually really helped, and I probably would have gotten 100%. Uh, but uh, it was pretty tough. You kind of get funneled in. All my guys ended up attacking buildings, and the cannons were just kind of able to free fire for most of the time. And I only end up getting one star, as you're going to see, which is pretty bad. It's still technically a victory, but... I don't even destroy the town hall. I did end up doing it again later on, and so I was able to get the three stars, but kind of didn't go into it very smart with a good plan, and obviously that made it very difficult to complete. So I'm definitely going to have to be more prepared going forward, and you can see my last few guys, uh, they don't stand a chance. They're just getting, they're going to get gunned down here, but... uh in this next uh, section for the next Goblin Village, I'm actually going to record things a little bit differently. You're going to see what I'm talking about in a second. So here we go. Alright guys, so here we are for the second attack on the Goblins at a Magonaut line it looks like. Uh, I actually messed up the recording before so you can see I already got three stars on it. But I'm going to do it again here. And I'm actually doing this one uh, a bit differently before I had been recording the gameplay and then doing a voiceover after for my own uh, audio, but this time I'm recording it uh, simultaneously, so essentially live with uh, my headphones plugged into my phone to uh, record it a bit differently, just, just to test it out a bit, see what you guys think of it. So here we go into the attack here. And so they got two cannons, we got a mortar as well, so I think we want to get rid of that mortar first. Drop some guys over here. Also drop some guys to take care of this. These are uh, cannons as well. So we got the mortar down. That's good. Get rid of that heavy duty artillery. Now our guys are working on the cannons as you can see. Both of them are almost gone. There they go. Both dropped there. So now at this point we just got to destroy the buildings. <laughs> there's, there's actually a bunch of uh, bombs on the ground so those did a lot of damage as well but I don't think there's any more so at this point it's just about destroying all the buildings town hall is about to go down and that uh, will get a nice 100 percent here and you can see there's, there's another bomb exploding but uh, there's the 100 percent didn't have to use all my troops so that's always good and uh, I hope you guys enjoyed that let me know what you think about the uh, live recording and doing it simultaneously or if you like better just the voiceover after I've recorded the gameplay so hope you guys enjoyed don't forget to leave a like subscribe and I'll see you next time peace